Every night before I go to sleep Find a ticket Win the lottery Scoop the pearls Up from the sea Cash them in and buy you all the things you need Every night before I rest my head See those dollar bills go swirling round my bed I know they're stolen But I don't feel I take that money, buy you things you never had, oh, babe. It would mean so much to me to buy you all the things you need for free. I buy you a jet plane, babe. Get you on a higher plane to a jet stream. Take you through the stratosphere. Check out all the planets there. Then you take it down deep where it's hot, hot in Arabia. Then cool, cold fields of snow. And we'll roll, dream, roll, dream, roll. Roll, dream, dream When we dream it When we dream it When we dream it We'll dream it Dream it for free, free money Free money, free money Free money, free money Free money Free money, 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 free money. You say you don't think it would help to pinpoint the exact moment we fell out of love, but you know me, grief cartographer plotting the coordinates of loss. Maybe it was the first time one of us needed to buy kitty litter, or toilet paper, or Drano to help fish me back out of the sink. Maybe it was in our first apartment together, fingers on a calculator trying to split the electric bill down to the degree of heat. But I remember each breakfast you prepared as if it were a nursery for a new child. I remember dyeing each other's hair the same boxed blonde. Maybe it was around the time you decided I must know I am pretty. Wouldn't look up from your phone as I took off my shirt and how quickly I got over my jealousy of Twitter or Candy Crush or whatever shiny thing you were looking at instead. But I remember when you got a mandolin and we started our own two-piece band. Our only audience, the roaches in the wall. Maybe it was halfway through the series of Gilmore Girls, or Game of Thrones, or House of Cards, or Dexter, or Bob's Burgers, or 30 Rock, or Arrested Development, or Broad City, or Girls, or Six Feet Under, or any of the shows we watched to distract ourselves from the fact that we shoved our sex in a time capsule and forgot where it was buried. Maybe it was when you took the overnight job and I got so used to the wideness of the bed that my arms grew like they were reaching for new people. But I remember when we found out it wasn't cancer. Maybe it was all those parties I lingered at, like smoke in the hair, as you tugged on my sleeve and begged me home. But I remembered our own secret language, how we could spend entire days talking like baby cats. And inside all of that cuteness, we stopped speaking the hard truth about how the water bill rose if I wasted the shower shaving my legs. And we were so broke, and I was so secure in our love, I stopped sneaking mouthwash to kiss you. Maybe it was while eating our 100th delivered pizza, or when I slept on the couch for longer than it hurt, but I remember lip syncing as you lip sync to the cure. I remember days when all we had was laughter. 
Maybe it was when my friend got punched in the face during sex and I was jealous, was so unbruised. You said my name the way my mother intended it. You were the gentle love I needed once or maybe it was a gradual thing. The tiniest hole in a tire, dragging the bicycle of our love up every hill. It's still too new to write this, but here I am, trying to get the bird's kind of view on our love when I am very much inside it, even sitting across from you now. I'm reminded of how gorgeous you are, your eyes, the same eyes I fell in love with, but sadder now. And I imagine the long line of girls who will love you in the way that you deserve. No, there isn't a single memory to blame. I remember the love notes you left on the most mundane things on the mirror, so damn beautiful. On the air conditioner, you are the coolest. And now we're in this tattoo parlor and this is not how I imagine getting matching tattoos with a lover. I move out of the apartment tomorrow. I pull my name off of our lease quick as a band-aid so you wouldn't feel it, but you felt it and we'll call these our divorce tattoos. And I'll get binoculars so I can see you even when you're far away, but you're always Whoa. far away way now. I remember when I made you a mix CD where every song had your name in a lyric because I read once that every person's favorite sound is their own name. For a while, your name was my favorite sound too. And then it was mine again. Maybe then. Natalie did. <laughs>